Hey, yeah, what's going on guys? Try back again here to bring you another video. This one's going to be talking about the Walking Dead issue 100. Uh, the cover has been released for the issue and then, you know, once we get there, I'll do a review for the, uh, the issue, obviously. But, watch this video because it's probably the coolest cover Charlie Adler has ever drawn for the comic book. And it also may foreshadow uh, some upcoming things in the uh, in the comic book series. So, uh, as issue 100 is coming up, obviously something big is going to happen. We know that we're going to see something really cool happen to celebrate the 100th issue of The Walking Dead. Um, the first cover, Charlie Adler's cover, the the standard cover, is probably the coolest drawn cover I've ever seen. Definitely the best Walking Dead cover I've ever seen. Um, click here to see it in high res uh, and then come back and watch this video afterwards. Uh, the high res image of this thing is humongous so I can't fit it inside this video and even if I put it in here could be dealing with copyright issues stuff like that. Image might get mad at me and screw up my, my YouTube account and stuff like that. So um, to describe what you're seeing basically after you click on that is we get to see in the background we've got Rick in The Walking Dead uh, issue 100 and then up front um, you know on both sides because obviously the cover is going to be this part and then the back is going to be this part if you open it up and you fold it out uh, you get to see all the characters from the first 100 issues of The Walking Dead pretty much that have not made it to this point that have died at this point and right at the front spoilers um, is Andrea's character so you can see Andrea at the front with some uh, marks on her neck like she's been bitten now um, it looks like it's Andrew. It doesn't at first I was like, are we sure it's Andrew? Or could it be her sister Amy? And I thought about it for a second because Amy did get bitten on the neck, but the way she was drawn in the comic book, she doesn't look exactly the same as Andrea. Andrea has these uh, dimples under her eyes and stuff like that. Dimples? Uh, yeah, I guess they kind of be like dimples type things, or um, uh, they're not like moles, but dimples or you know just uh, skin, you know abrasions, freckles below her eyes. Like maybe they're supposed to be freckles, but whatever. Either way, it looks like her, and uh, every other character there is 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 uh, dead in, in their form that they were dead in. So you got at the left side, you got the governor, um, and you've got behind him, you've got uh, Tyrese is just his head, <laughs> just his head, and then all the other characters there. And as you go back and you start looking as they fade out, you start to see other characters. So you're like, oh, I remember that character. I remember that. And there's Herschel and. And you can you can point out all these other characters in the past that have uh, that have died. It's very very cool. It's probably the coolest cover ever. Also, there's going to be five variants for it. Um, let me just look up the list here. Uh, yeah, there's going to be five variant covers. Charlie Adler doing this one, of course, which is the best cover ever. Uh, also, uh, I've heard that uh, Todd McFarlane is going to do going to do a variant cover for The Walking Dead. That's a must have, man. Todd McFarlane's take on it. That's going to be that's going to be sick. Um, Silvestri, Frank Quietly. Uh, Brian Hitch, uh, Sean Phillips, and Ryan Otley. So that's sick, man. Five of the best uh, comic book artists. Uh, there are is that five or six. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, so six, six total, including Charlie Adler. No, seven, seven total. Um, yeah, yeah, seven total for for covers for the Walking Dead issue 100. Anyway, uh, I don't know what uh, Tom and Farland's going to bring, but uh, this cover is cool. Now, that being said, that's not necessarily confirming that Andrew's going to die by issue 100. I mean, we don't we don't know that for sure. Um, you know, I who knows what will happen with that if she's going to die or if she'll make it. Just because it's on the cover doesn't necessarily mean it's going to happen uh, exactly that way. You know, sometimes they draw covers for the one thing, and it, that might not exactly happen in the story. So hopefully Andrew doesn't die because I think she's one of the coolest characters in the comic book and the TV show. Um, but, uh, you know, it's issue 100, so some, some something's got to go down. If it's not somebody dying, something big's got to go down. Anyway, uh, those are my thoughts on the Walking Dead cover issue 100. Um, check it out. It's freaking cool. Uh, other than that, that's pretty much all I got to say for now. Later, guys. Peace.